I don't care who killed the prostitutes. If Crane was helping himself to the community coffers, it means his hand was in my pocket, and you just let him go! I don't know what you heard, but it didn't happen like that. Are you denying the facts? Uh, she's denying me the chance to get a word in. Now, Miss White, Sheriff I... Sheriff Bigby has returned. Ah, there's the old wrecking bowl himself. Bigby, where have you been? I'm not finished here, Miss White. You will have to wait. <sighs> just one moment, please. Look what I found. Seems your dog wants a biscuit. Yeah, Buffy, get this piece in the mirror right away. With pleasure, Miss White. <sighs> Finally, things are swinging back in the right direction. Good work, Bigby. You've been gone all day. What did you uncover? I thought you were going to report back to me. I mean, it's fine. So what else did you find out? All the paper tons and I gotta say, this thing reaches a lot further than we thought. The crooked man has something on everybody. It wasn't just beauty and the loan. Beast was working for him. His goon, the Jersey Devil, is putting the squeeze on all kinds of fables down at the Lucky Pawn. And he's got fables enslaved at the butcher shop, making black market magic. This is worse than we could have imagined. But that's over now. Because we got the mirror, and once it's fixed, we got him. That's how Crane did it. That's how we're gonna do it. Excellent work. Really. Sheriff, I could use your assistance. Would you join me at the mirror? Hmm, that's click merkwürdig. Don't go far, Sheriff. I'd like to have a few words of my own with you. Unbelievable. Talk we'll talk soon. Don't worry. We'll talk soon. You can count on it. I don't understand. This piece just doesn't want to join the rest. Do you have any idea why? Got me. Well, where did you find it? What has it gone through since being separated from the rest? Shattering is a very traumatic experience, you know. So this process can be a little touchy. It helps that I have a good working relationship with her. <laughs> and I don't mind Mary. speaking in rhyme. Mary, got your hands on it. Can you think of anything? I found it in Crane's coat. The last person I saw with Crane or his coat was that psycho Bloody Mary. Maybe she had Ah, uh, yes, Miss White was asking about her. That explains it. You know who and the mirror have a very unhappy history with each other. Well, how would you like it if she tried to use you as a doorway? I think I already know the feeling. Well, I think I know how to proceed now. It will just take a little extra coaxing, that's all. Thank you for your help. It could be a while, Sheriff. I'll find you when it's ready. Besides which, he might not want to come out with you watching. Oh. He doesn't like being spied on. If you ask me, you're everything that's wrong with Fable Town. Is it fixed? Did you ask about the crooked man? Buffkin's still working on it. He said it might be a while. If you're so self-reliant, what do you want from the business office so bad? What I want is my business. I, I can't take those two right now. We're trying to catch a murderer, and they're... They're over there bickering about bureaucracy. We're at war. Don't they realize that? You need some help over there? Yeah, thanks. Go talk to Toad. But just so you know, we can't pay him. He really needs to go to the farm, you know. So just break the news and be done with it, okay? Hm. Wir haben auch ein bisschen Geld eingesackt. Toad, come here. I thought I made myself very clear. I see how it is. Passed off to an underling, eh? Why am I not surprised? Well, you did cause what damage brings me in here, so maybe it's for the best. Just need a little bit of dosh to cover it. I tried talking to her about it, but it's like chatting up a brick wall, it is. Now, I'm sure you've got your own agenda, Sheriff, but I've taken a real wallet because of you. Where's the clever? deny that. I'm starting to think you don't take me seriously, Toad. How many times have I told you to get glamoured up? You know that if you're out of glamour, I gotta send you to the farm. Well, how about your friend the pig, hmm? Is he going to the farm too? Yeah, you thought we didn't know about him, huh? A worst kept secret in Fable Town. For a friend, the rules will bend. I'm understand the book call. Slope, that is. I haven't decided on him yet. Every situation's different, Toad. Well, might I suggest a path of compassion for the pig? And me and me boy, too. 
If you give me one more chance and hear me out, I'll see a way for me and me boy to stay. I'm not going to ask for any more than I need. I just want to stay. So what do you say? You just give me enough to cover me glamours and we'll call the rest a wash. Please, Sheriff. Don't take TJ from the only home he knows. His old glamour rule is oppressive. I've done nothing wrong but look different. You know it's not right. Burdening the weakest of us like this. This world isn't kind to those of us who can't pass for Oh, I do what I can. Look, I'll try to get you that money and get you another chance, but you have to understand, that's not entirely up to me. Oh, thank you, Sheriff. I knew I could count on you to make me whole again. We get this sorted and I'll be glamoured to the nines, I will. Uh-oh. <laughs> Bluebeard, you want to talk? Now's your chance. I've just made my donation funding this office, so direct your questions to Miss White. Well, at least he's not trying to get rid of me. He's not? For now. Did you take care of Toad? I mean, I saw the way he left. I know it may not seem that important right now, but glamours are the law for a very good reason. You know that as well. I did the right thing. Don't worry. I did the right thing. Are you sure? Because he left looking pretty happy. <sighs> Fine. We'll deal with it later. I know I should be asking how it got like this, but I just keep wondering why it happened to Faith and Lily. You've seen his world. Do you have any idea why he'd want them dead? I don't know if the crooked man killed them with his own hand or if it was one of his goons, but someone did. What would make a person do that? It's what could control. those girls have done? If there's one thing I've figured out, it's that the crooked man is all about control. It's what he does with the loans at the pawn shop. The magic he peddles. Chains. Ribbons. Maybe Faith and Lily weren't doing what they were told. Or maybe they just tried to leave. Sheriff! Miss White! I believe the mirror is repaired. I have to say, I have been better. But thanks for putting me back together. I'm sorry, I just... I have to know. Mirror, mirror, we're glad you weren't slain. Now please show us that sick creep crane. Hmm. He's probably still... Is that a good idea? Up a little. Are you really sure you want to see him? You will get on that plane to Paris, and you will wait for the day the Crooked Man needs you. Until then, not a peep. Otherwise, I get to deal with you my way. So please, please disobey. Wait a minute. Someone's watching. What just happened? We pointed you in the wrong direction and looked at Bloody Mary's reflection. Oh, her. That explains the sting. I'd rather not have to feel the pain she brings. So, let's not do that again, okay? Looks like we'll have to track him down later. You're right. We need to focus on the immediate threat, and that's the Crooked Man. Bigby, we don't have a lot of time. Are you having trouble with the rhyme, Sheriff? Mirror, mirror. Uh, mirror, mirror. No time to pout. So, where does Crooked Man hang out? I don't recognize the door, but that's the Crooked Man symbol on it. Hold on. Er wandert tatsächlich hin und her. The door. It moves. Yeah. Jersey mentioned that. Wait a minute. I know that door. That's Central Park. I don't know when it's gonna move again, but I'm gonna get there before it does. Bigby, wait. When you get the Crooked Man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. This can't be like it was with Tweedledum. I don't care if it gets out of hand. You don't let it come to that. I know that emotions can run high, and you have your reasons to handle this a certain way. But we have to make a commitment to no, working guarantees. within the law. I can't make that promise. 
This could turn sour, just depending on how the wind blows. I have to be able to handle it how I see fit. If people are going to have faith in the Fable Town government again, we need to be fair. Show them that we're doing things the right way. I have enough to worry about here while I prepare the case against him. So I'm going to trust you to handle this properly. That is, if you think you're ready. Of course I'm ready. I got no other choice. Oh je, das ordnungsgemäß abzuhandeln. Wenn der mit uns wieder einen ordentlichen Fight beginnt, dann haben wir ein Problem. Und Big B ist eh schon sauer. Da haben wir die Tür. Ich hoffe, es verschwindet jetzt nicht direkt. Und einfach mal durch. Und... Ciao. Eine alte Festung ist ja hochinteressant. Tim, what the hell are you doing here? Good evening, Sheriff. I'm here to take you to the boss. Thanks, by the way, for leaving off Tiny. Tiny Tim. You'd think I'd have outgrown that century Check ago. It. I have to admit, when they asked me to watch the door, I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. I know you aren't here on a social call, so thanks for not giving me a hard time. You were expecting Hold me? Hold on. You've just been waiting for me to show up? You knew I was coming? That's what they told me. I don't know, they said you made it pretty clear. I'm supposed to bring you right on in, so if you'll come this way. Look, this is the one thing I have to do. Please don't make this hard on me. I don't want to get in trouble. Will you just follow me? I will follow you. Fine, lead on. And where the hell are they? Thanks for understanding. This is all I'm here to do, and I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> I know I'm probably the last person you'd expect to be a guard, or an escort for that matter. I was a little surprised myself when they asked me to do it. I thought it was a joke, actually. You're a part of this? An easy target. Tim, how can you be working here? You know who this guy is, don't you? He's not... He's not as bad as you think. He doesn't treat me like some broken little kid. I think he gets what it's like. He gave me a job. And I'm lucky to have it. This is the only option I've got. Just keep that in mind, maybe? Because if you and the boss go up against each other, the rest of Fable Town is going to get caught in the middle. And if you're here, it can't be good. So I hope you two can come to Find an another job. I understand the position you're in, but you don't have to do this. There are other things you could do. So it's just that easy. Maybe not, but you don't want to be a part of this. A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. We need you, but we need him too. What we don't need is a war. Hey, Sheriff, hold up. I gotta go in with you. Can't you just wait up, Sheriff? Wait for him. Thanks. <laughs> Am I some kind of a fucking joke to you? What did I tell you, eh? Stop laughing at me. Oh, yeah? Mate, Who's back there? I ain't scared of you. Tell me who the He's fuck the is back there. I got a problem with. I, I don't exactly know. I, I just mind the door. The boss is there. I'm sure he will prove himself quite handy much. to have in my pocket. Either he's smart enough to see this is for the best, or dim enough to do as he's told. I say he'd be more useful killed, skinned, and made into a rug for me to wipe my shoes on. That bloody monster killed my poor brother. He's right. He was Dumbledore. fine when Crane was smoothing things over, but this guy off his leash is a whole other barrel of crap that I don't want to deal with. So that's it then. Let's slip the dogs of war. Hmm? None of you can see fit to stare him down. The best outcome you can picture is having him dead. 
I like to think a little bigger than that. You're not frightened, are you? Yeah, it's easy for you to say. He didn't pull the claws out on you. We will tame the whelp, and I pray he will eventually be of more use to us alive. Well, I don't like it. It's not for you to like. Okay. Excuse me, but I have a job to do. Sheriff Wolf, sir. Thank you, Tim. I know the sheriff isn't the accommodating sort, but you handled it. You did well. You can go now. Thank you, sir. You see, everyone in Fable Town has a role to fill. You just have to pay attention to what they need to help them find it. Mit denen alle sich anzulegen? Wahrscheinlich. Alright, let's talk. Alright, you got me here. Let's talk. Next time. I've heard stories about you. In the old days, how you picked off those men one by one. Oh, how they screamed. The wolf is coming. And they would wait. Hiding anywhere they could squeeze their pathetic, shivering corpses. Some would just drop to their knees where they stood, close their eyes, and wait for death. And you'd give it to them. <laughs> I wish I could have seen it. <sighs> oh well. Okay. Na, da bin ich doch mal sehr äh, gespannt darauf, was dort passieren soll. Do you send Colin to the farm? You and 90... Oh Gott, nur so wenig. Okay. Wollten ihn dort nicht hinschicken. Schade. Um, there is a ribbon. Haben wir natürlich nicht versucht. Aber auch nur die... Äh, circa die Hälfte. Operation Investigation 50-50. Did you send Toad to the farm? Wir haben es versucht, anders zu regeln und nur 20% haben angenommen, zuerst mit ihm zu reden. Okay. Das heißt wohl, wir sehen uns wieder in Episode 5, bei dem das Ganze sein Ende finden wird. Muss dazu aber jetzt echt gestehen, so langsam stört mich es ein klein wenig, dass die ganzen Episoden in tay, -Tay game Reihe, ob jetzt The Walking Dead Season 2 oder eben hier The Wolf Among Us, immer kürzer werden. Die Entscheidungen relativ simpel, entweder du gehst links oder du gehst rechts. Am Ende hat man trotzdem irgendwie alles und ähm, ja, die große Entscheidungsfreiheit oder die Entdeckerfreiheit noch so ein bisschen vertiefen, das würde ich mir doch sehr wünschen. Hoffe, dass sie das wenigstens jetzt in einem grandiosen Finale abblasen. Und ansonsten sehen wir uns wieder. Bis dahin. Ciao.